I'm really interested to see what's going to happen in the next election and in the next administration, whether it's Obama or whoever it is, um, with a couple of issues, but, but one in particular that I think is coming to a head really quickly is gay marriage and gay rights. I really feel that in about 10 years we'll be on the other side of it and we'll be like, what was the big deal? Uh, the world did not fall apart. Um, I personally believe that that gay marriage should be recognized by the government. Um, and I've yet to hear, I've yet to hear an answer that does not involve a church as to why it shouldn't. Um, we expect our citizens, gay, straight, everybody, to be contributing members of society, to uh, pay taxes and participate, and, you know, then in turn we, the government and everybody, we, we get roads paved, we call the police, the police show up, hopefully, you know, <laughs> God forbid there's a fire, the fire department comes. And whether you are gay or straight, it, it doesn't matter, you still pay those taxes, you still uh, have those services open to you and you are protected under the law by your rights. I have, I can find no reason why our gay citizens aren't afforded those same rights. They uh, pay the taxes and participate in every way that straight people do and yet aren't given that protection and it's especially important in cases of adoption and families being torn apart and God forbid one one partner is injured in the hospital and is isn't able to visit the other one or make the the life-changing decisions that a partner should make simply because the marriage isn't sanctioned by the law that being said churches have every right every right to either sanction or not sanction gay marriages, to, to, <laughs> what's the word I'm looking for? To recognize them or to not. But our government, I feel very strongly, needs to because these are our citizens. These are our brothers and our sisters and our children. I have two sons and I, I, if they are gay or straight, it doesn't matter to me. I want them to be protected. I want them to be, cared for. I want the laws to protect them the same way I want the laws to protect your children, to protect you. I'm a little heated about this <laughs> subject, aren't I? Anyway, I, I'm really interested to see what's going to happen with it, in particular with the Republican candidates, because um, I find that they are tending to ease more towards going, uh, hey, this isn't a horrible thing. Um, and I think it's a tricky line for President Obama, but I think that the more our citizens, both gay and straight, stand up and say, all of our citizens must be protected under the law, all of them. Law-abiding citizens must be protected by the law. They must be afforded the same rights. Uh, I think that we will, we will get there. Very, uh, quicker than than a lot of people are thinking, I hope. Anyway, and um, I I really do believe that this this country is just flipping amazing. It's an incredible country. I'm so blessed to be born here, so blessed with the opportunities as a woman, uh, and as a, as a human being to to be afforded this opportunity to look into a camera and talk too long. 